Yeah, hi. In this video, I am going to show you on how to um, create an asset invoice. So now, um, by this time, we already know how much is the production unit. So we already maintained. So now, how to change the asset before you are posting an invoice? You go to AS02. So to go into the AS02, this is the code. So is a, I think I already explained in my beginner video on how to change a set. So you just double click on it and go to the depreciation area. And then you, you just look for the production units method, remaining units, depreciation key and double click. So here, here you can post it. Yeah. Production unit, click OK. So now you can maintain the depreciation start date. So the depreciation start date here is 2020 January. So I am going to maintain January. So click OK. So now we already maintain. So you can see now. So now if I go and check the asset values, so I don't see any data, right? Because nothing is posted there. So in the master data, I already maintain my capitalization date or if you don't maintain any date here, so system will take your first invoice date. So now how to post the incoming invoice for the fixed assets. You go to the fixed asset, posting, acquisition and external acquisition. So with the vendor, just double click. So now we have to refer back our business scenario, what I explained here. So when you look into this business scenario, you already clear on what is the invoice amount. This is the cost of the missionary. So now 0101-2020, 0101-2020. So it doesn't matter which currency. So I'm using this company. So click OK, put the vendor so you can maintain all any of these fields. Click OK, enter. So I have to again, maybe this is not in this company code. So I should choose a different vendor belongs to this company code. So I just randomly select any vendor. So here I'm going to use NJB Enterprises. Click OK. So the value don't you already remember eight thousand eight hundred thousand. Yeah. So now let put seventy. So what is our asset number which we already created? So if you look asset zero two. So. 2007 is our asset. So now enter 2007. When you are posting with this transaction uh, posting key, you must enter the transaction type. Always for fixed asset. Click OK. So the system will take uh, some processing time. Then it will show you. So now click press enter so here I should say the zero percent input tax let's say this is a tax free asset let's assume because you are generating some revenue so you can enter the description that is a missionary so click uh, simulate the document now you can see click on post so after it's posting then the system will generate a document number so you can see the document so let's go asset values go back Nothing still not yet posted. It's, it's still processing and it will take some time maybe 
to generate internal views sometimes it run quite longer to date perhaps so if you see now the document is posted so if you look into the document this is our document which is posted today so now if you want to display the document click on display so it will show the document or else you can always refer this is a document which is posted.